Hey, good morning, you guys. Hey, uh, I posted this morning about having a non-aero trailer, and I kind of wanted to explain what that was. I, I misspoke a little bit. It's not completely non-aero. Uh, the trailer I've got does have the skirts. However, what I'm missing, uh, to me, it makes the biggest difference is the tails. Let me get back here and show you. No tails, just flat. So what that does, that creates a lot of wind turbulence back there. Almost creates a little bit of suction. Makes truck work harder to get me down the road. So right now, I'm sitting at 11 miles a gallon. There's a very loud truck. Sitting at 11 miles a gallon uh, with 13,000 pounds. The difference is, uh, I'm on pretty flat ground now, not a, ter a, lot, a lot of terrain change. So, uh, I should actually be higher. That tail's good for a half, maybe three quarters of a mile a gallon. I'm just off the top of my head, but that seems about right. And I can tell a difference when I don't have it. So, the reason these numbers will be uh, interesting today is because I will be on a lot of flat ground. I'm just headed down to Texas. And, um be interesting to see the difference in what this trailer does compared to the fully aero trailer I had uh, going up over the Rockies and back with heavier loads so we'll keep you posted but I wanted to clarify that a little bit and answer the questions if you had it you guys have a great day and we will see ya